All right, now a lot of intrigue about this one here. There's a new exhibit in West Palm Beach, and it's all about the Titanic. Yeah, guests get to go on the adventure to see how the ship was constructed, the luxurious interior, and then, of course, the ultimate demise. There is that part, right? T.A. Walker shining a light on the exhibit. And T.A., back in 1912, ships would communicate via Morse code. Is that part of the exhibit? It really is, and I want to get to that in just a moment, but I first want to start with this grand stairway that you're, you may remember from the Titanic, Titanic movie, but I'm going to flip it around and talk to Christian here, and as we're talking here, Christian, tell me about this first-class cabin. Yeah, so one of the big showcases here in the Titanic exhibit is going to be our cabin replicas. So what we're looking at is our first-class cabin, which was reserved for the wealthiest of passengers, our businessmen and politicians that have all the fixings. And then panning over to the lesser cabin, our third class cabin, you can see it's a uh, bunk bed styles that fit up to four, uh, but this was still considered very luxurious compared to other cruise liners at that time. Now, first class cabins had running water, but the third class cabins had a basin? Yes, one of these basin dishes that you can see, one of these real artifacts that we have. Uh, but again, these, uh, these third class cabins were still quite pricey for their time. And you can see along the way, there's all these artifacts, some replicas, some real, and I wanna run way over here to ask answer Ashley Glass's question about Morse code and talk to Kristen and Kristen there Morse code was pivotal for this time right it was it was so we have here components of of uh, wireless uh, transmitter so we have the gap transmitter all done by sending and receiving uh, messages through ham radio so this is the gap transmitter here so we would flip the switch and it would tap they would tap those messages. So the West Palm Beach Amateur Radio Club has fitted you out with a current version of this, and we can type W, right? Yes. So how do we do W? Short, long, long, and then we can do P, short, long, long, short, and then, then T, let's, where's the T, where's the T? One long, uh -huh. and V let's, is short, 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 long. So there we go, Ashley and Holony. We just Morse code WPTV. I can you do Ashley Glass, Holony Davis next time? Would that take too long? I'm so fascinated by that. I feel like that might take an hour. I don't have that much battery life in my <laughs> okay, phone. Okay, fine. Next time. <laughs> or patience. Okay, thanks, DA. If you've